uh, hey everyone this is umakan welcome all of you to my channel so uh, here i am going to have a series for brc 2023 scientist uh, c uh, for physics discipline only so here i am going to explain a lot of uh, questions that comes from the student side uh, as you know i had appeared for this examination from last 3 years in 2020 2021 and 2022 and i had cracked this exam for two times and i had appeared for the interview for the two times also but uh, i could not uh, crack the interview so that the story of mine so uh, here i am to explain the basic uh, previous year questions and strategies for this written exam because written exam is not going to be easy for crack because now it is competition is high and second thing is this exam needs a very uh, speed and accuracy uh, kind of things to crack okay uh, because there will be 100 question and your time will be 2 hour and question is will be not like easy that you can see and answer the question so you have to solve the question that the thing uh, in physics that you have to use the pen for getting the answer that it will take time definitely okay so how to minimize the time and have a uh, good score in the examination that my uh, point is so let let you know that uh, how to prepare for this examination uh, so first of all we should discuss about the uh, written exam question level for brc okay so basically people are uh, writing to me that how to prepare for brc so that's why i thought that i should make a uh, general package of question and its uh, solution so that you can get a uh, brief idea about this examination and you can prepare your strategy by yourself okay that's the point so uh, if you ask me about the written co- level uh, question level for brc scientific officer c for physics discipline uh, then i would like to uh, say one thing that question level is mostly uh, easy to moderate okay question level will be mostly from easy to moderate kind okay so basically there will be 100 question so there will be 100 question and time will be 2 hours so time constant will be there for the written exam if you can balance your time and your accuracy speed and accuracy then no doubt you can crack the examination for so for this exam so i can see you uh, say you that speed and accuracy is the uh, two important factor and uh, both are complemented to each other okay so because normalization is there so you have to uh, score, attempt uh, with accuracy okay so question level will be mostly from easy to moderate okay so question level will be from easy to moderate so you will get nearly 30 to 35 question uh, easy question which can you easy in the sense you can uh, put the formula you can put the your small concept then you can get the answer from the out of four option you can easily click that this is the answer that kind of scenario will be there but uh, you will have the 20 to 30 or you can say 30 to 40 moderate question that you have to use your brain little bit and you have to uh, do some calculation to get the answer that kind of scenario will be there so nearly it will be like 30 to 40 then it will be like 30 to 40 uh, then uh, 20 question will be uh, very uh, like you can say you have to go deeper concept to have the answer okay 20 question will be like that so mostly the distribution will be like few questions will be very easy few question will be moderate kind of thing and few question will be very difficult that very difficult means it will take time okay you have to leave it that the point is okay uh, everyone can solve it but it will take time to say oh, that's why you have to leave the question so that the point so this kind of scenario will be there in the examination okay so that the point that is written in the examination will carry mostly easy to moderate kind of question and few uh, difficult kind of question so how to prepare and time is very less on you so basically your gate examination was there in 12th february so uh, brc has already advertised the uh, really the advertisement for occ and dgfs so its written exam will be there in the month of march march mid march like that so you have a very less amount of time in your hand so you should start practicing the question that my point is you have to practice the question so instead of going through the books now you should start practicing lot of question so what will should you should practice okay so i will tell you uh, uh, told you uh, i would like to suggest to that so you start preparing gate question so you already have practiced the gate question and ses and net question so you just go through the bhu bhu msc entrance question okay msc entrance question so start practicing few question from bsc uh, msc entrance question from bhu university then hyderabad central university msc question you can practice because this kind of uh, uh, this kind of level you will get in the examination okay so this two i i had practiced during my time that is bhu msc question and scu msc question from last four to five year you can practice that can be not that effective and it will make you confident because that kind of small small question will get you are going to 
uh, appear for the uh, you will get to going to a half in the examination so that kind of uh, thing will be effective for you so that the point you should start practicing and second thing never miss get previous year question previous year question never miss because uh, i will describe in previous yearly i have i have I had got a lot of uh, question from the previous year. In 2020, I had remembered a lot of question work there. So that point, I should, I would like to suggest to go through this BH1, SU, MSc entrance question from at least five year. Then you have, you will get the confidence that you can. Then this slide is important. What is the safe score and analysis of last year three, last three year got up? So as I mentioned, I had cracked this 2020 and 2021 written exam and I had appeared for the interview, but I did not crack this 2022 written exam because I was here in IIT Bombay in first year PhD. So there is a lot of pressure. I do not practice the question. I had missed this examination for five to six mark. I had remembered clearly. So that's the different part of the story. So what, what was the cutoff? Basically, if you analyze the previous year paper for physics, in 2020-20, I had remembered uh, it was in the examination was there in Nagpur when I was in MSc second year in NIT. So question was very easy. So you can directly say question was very easy to moderate. Why? Because in this year, I had remembered 20 to 25 question was directly copied from previous year gate and net question. You have to just see the question, then you will recall that this is the answer because uh, a lot of practice is there for gate examination. So 20 to 25 previous year question was copied. So it will make the uh, examination very easy to crack. So cut off for that year was 151.2 I think. Okay. And I had uh, the, uh, scored 153 point something because normalization is there. So you have to uh, conscious about the, your accuracy. So this is the scene for 2020 cut off was 151 point something was there. Then if you come back to 2020-21. So I had uh, remembered this examination was there in Odisha. I had appeared for the exam in Bhubaneswar. So 2021-21, the course scenario was total different. That uh, I had feel a very uh, difficult kind of situation was there. That I just uh, uh, fear after seeing the question because question was very difficult. Okay, so I just solved 47 question in this year. In that year, I had just solved 45 to 47. I had clearly remembered. So cut off was very less, cut off was 123 or 121 like this, cut off was very less below 130, okay. So I had cracked this examination, the question level is hard, so I just, uh, uh, I just clear inside the hall that question is difficult, so I have to attend with 100% accuracy, that means more than 90% accuracy I should maintain in this examination so that I can crack. So attend less and, uh, and uh, improve your accuracy, that's the point, but in the 20, but in the year of 2020-22, I was here in Mumbai, I had appeared for the examination. Question was coming to this level, 2020 Question was uh, easy to moderate. So it needed a lot of practice that I lacked. Okay. So I just scored 145 to 146, I think. But the cutoff was like 153 or 151, like this cutoff was there. So it is just re recalling this 2020 button. Okay. So from the last three years, you can make a conclusion that you can make a conclusion that so in this year question was easy to moderate okay cut off was 150 plus 151 like that 150 plus means 151 and 152 like this kind of thing is there so in 2020 21 question was difficult question was difficult and cut off come to 121 123 okay so you can say 120 plus okay but in the year of this 2020-22, question becomes very easy to moderate. So cut off reaches to 150 plus, 153. So one thing is there, if question is seems to be lengthy, question if question is seems to be lengthy and if you difficult to solve within the time, then be sure question is difficult. So cut off will be like this, 120, 125, okay, below 130. If question seems to be very easy and you can just comfortable in the examination, then be sure cut up will be 150 plus. So you should try to solve more than 50 questions, more than 60 questions. That's the point. You should be clear by yourself. Okay. So come to the next slide. Which part of physics is more crucial? Yes. From my experience of last three years. So you should not miss this solid state physics. Please don't miss this solid state physics, atomic molecular physics and this nuclear physics. They will definitely put nearly 10 questions from this, nearly 10 questions from this, nearly 10 questions from this. 
okay basically this is the atomic molecular area that people are mostly working and solid state division is there so definitely they will put question from this section so never neglect this part then okay so this part must be clear at least formulas basic concept basic few few small small questions okay then as for uh, as you know from physics uh, that quantum mechanics will be definite will definitely be there so mathematical physics small complex analysis question matrix determinant linear independence okay so that kind of vectors algebra and uh, that uh, fourier transform question will be there so that kind of small small question that we can immediately solve that kind of scenario will be there classical mechanics like lagrange and hamilton are very fundamental question uh, so rotational momentum inertia uh, and uh, you can go for the gravity question last year they put okay i have remembered that they put a gravity question so okay plus or related the question will be there so then they put the relativity one small question will be there rigid body motion okay so that uh, central force motion potential will be given and angular frequency will be there so that kind of question will be there like in this year of gate they have asked the two marks question from that concept so then you can statistical mechanics yes, from statistical mechanics and thermodynamics is more important thermodynamics is more important than statistical mechanics in big were last 2 to 3 year they are putting definitely 3 to 4 question from thermodynamics cannot cycle the second law of thermodynamics first law of thermodynamics that thermodynamical potential uh, mixing temperature of final temperature after mixing that kind of question will be there small question but definitely it will uh, uh, definitely will be there okay then electronics point of view if you ask me then electronic analog are uh, taking little less weightage in the examination but they will go for the de digital part that they will put some logic uh, logic uh, digital part they are putting uh, bolan algebra and uh, they are putting them <coughs> logic gates and uh, that kind of scenario will be there you can solve it but point is you should not make mistake okay so because question only very small so making probability of making mistake is more making mistake is more so if you avoid this silly mistake and you can focus on the accuracy and the speed so you can crack because this examination is all about this accuracy and speed the accuracy and speed is more important i am just repeating this thing time to time you just practice those thing go through the previous year bhu and su question whatever question you are getting on the fundamental point of view or standard point of view you just practice it and try to solve within uh, minimum time that you can take okay so then how much you should score for bsc so as i mentioned if question is seems to be hard for you if question is seems to be hard for you so cut up will be definitely 120 to 130 okay so if you attend 50 plus 50 to 60 then it is more than enough okay but accuracy should be there and you are just attempt to 50 to 60 and you are making 20 wrong attempt then how you can crack okay so you you just uh, focus on your accuracy in that case but if question seems to be easy and comfortable for you so cut up will be definitely 150 150 plus because now it is competition is huge okay and in that case you have to uh, score you have to attempt nearly 70 plus or 60 plus definitely 60 plus then you can solve because in question easy you have to attend lot then you will make the mistakes okay that mistake will uh, take you lower down and then um, normalization is there so sip normalization will be there so uh, you just have to focus on that part okay so if so new how you, your preparation is there and uh, that, that that's how you will feel the question is your difficult okay if you not prepare anything definitely you will feel hard okay so then few previous year question uh, yeah this the, i will describe all the previous year question very briefly in the upcoming video so uh, for the sake of information from the uh, standard of the question uh, i just have remembered two question from one from thermodynamics the question was like uh, you know the change in entropy ds equal to dq by t for the total entropy you have to integrate this dq by t if you this put this dq is equal to mc dt that is in the most specific heat so and the limit will be t1 to t1 to tf that is final temperature to initial to final temperature it will be mc ln tf by ti okay so they have put the tf and ti just ask the what will be entropy this kind of question was there then they put a uh, question from mathematical physics i had remembered uh, yeah pole and singularity pole and singularity residue uh, this question will be definitely there yeah. they will put a, they will just give a z equal to 2 by z q okay so you know z equal to 0 is the singular point they will ask the residue you have to take the uh, this uh, pole of order 3 so you have to differentiate two times so this differentiation should be quick that the scenario who can solve this question within 
a uh, few second then he can be the champion in this examination okay so you have no time you have to immediately see the question and have to solve that the scenario of the exam question exam you have to just run behind the question okay so uh, that the whole package of this video is so next video i'll uh, describe a few questions from the previous year so be sure the question exam is going to be very competitive very uh, like very uh, cracking of this exam is not very easy because question will be very uh, like you have to solve this quickly uh, which will make you uh, keep uh, make you a trouble for you because quick solve is not an easy task for physics discipline so be pra uh, practice well for the examination be confident you can do it definitely you can do it okay so thank you for watching my video thank you so much